everyone, it's Pizza Bombs, and today I am showing you the secret that I said that there was in last video, which was the iron farm, but today I'm showing it to you. It took a long time, probably about a week, uh, and I'm just going to give you a tour of it. I'm not going to say what it is yet, but I'm going to show you after I go to sleep. So let's go to sleep, uh, and then I shall show you. It is time to show you what I have built. Completely survival, completely by myself. And it's in the shopping district. It is in... Airport. This took probably about one or two inventories worth of concrete but I personally like it so we're, I'm just gonna show you the runway first do you like the runway but now we're just gonna take the tour of the airport so after you come down on the runway you get the entrance you go up the entrance and then you go this way if you want to fly again <laughs> but then here's the entrance and after you go to the entrance there's this little waiting lobby like there is in um in uh oh my goodness in, in airports there's this little waiting area and there's glass so you can see airports coming in or airplanes coming in and out airplanes are just players but whatever and you've got the staircase to the second floor this is the shopping floor and the exit now the shopping floor uh players can wipe down this bars change up some of the walls a bit change some of that up and then they can set up a mini shop so I'm gonna do that for one of those I'm not sure yet I've still got to finish building this one this will just be a bigger one so then when you exit you just fall into water pretty easy and if you want to re-enter you go to the third floor and now you've got the um the metal detectors they don't actually do anything they're for cool looks and then your baggage goes in here I've got a lot of baggage but it's just like shulker boxes and whatnot and you go through and then you can pick up your baggage this one probably took the least amount of work. I am going to add a few more shop things up here too. They're probably going to be smaller. Uh, but that's basically the airport part. Uh, man, this is going to be a shorter video than I thought. Okay. Uh, then you can also cross over through here um, if you want to get to the shopping district. And then there's the ATC tower. Now if you're not sure what ATC stands for, it's for air traffic control. And that's for making sure that planes don't crash into each other and stuff. Yeah, mainly so planes don't crash into each other. So, uh, that's basically that. Um, holy cow, I cannot go through that in fifth person. Third person. Uh, but this is the ATC tower. There is a long thing of stairs, but I don't go through the stairs. I just go through the trident up. Whee! Except there is that little trap door right there, so I have to be kind of careful to get it right. There we go, and then I can just close it. And then this is the ATC tower. If there is an ATC, they can just sit up here. They can watch and be like, yay, you can land, yay, you can take off. And then there's a clock and a compass. <coughs> um, yeah, that's most of the airport. It, oh, there's one secret feature. Now, um, headphone users, beware. This is the emergency feature. It's... Um, when this is activated, when this is activated, these bells activate along with these, these lights, and there's no place. Basically, when those bells are on, it's telling you, hey, there's an emergency, someone's incoming, clear the runway. If that's why you have to clear the one runway, no one else can land unless it's the designated person. Uh, what the, what the? Cool. I didn't know that was an achievement. Hmm. Cool. Okay, that's cool. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Um. That's it for this video. I guess it's just gonna be a short look what I built video. Now. Um.